With the attack coming from two sides, the snake tries retreat. This unheard of tactic rouses the jaguar to a new pitch of resentment. He's determined to see this through to a decision. And this monster is not going to be the one that got away, not if he can help it. Can a 200-pound jaguar hold a 300-pound snake? That's the question now. finally prevails, and now the battle moves to an element the snake likes better. Every creature has a last-ditch strategy. The snake's is this. Lure the enemy in over his death, then seize him in the muddy waters. Most creatures would see the danger developing and think twice before stepping into the trap, but not the jaguar. He doesn't care about danger. His blood is up, and he means business, and so he goes after the giant reptile. occurs one bad moment when the cat seems terribly close to suffocation. His mate moves in to help, but before she can get into the fray, the male manages to break the stranglehold. Now he has the enemy out on dry land again. For all its great strength, the snake is beginning to show signs of exhaustion. Its movements have become sluggish, and its reflexes slow. All it can do now is to try to protect its vulnerable head. Finally, death comes. The dreaded reptile lies limp and lifeless. The moment the enemy